Have you ever wondered what happens in your brain while you sleep? Well, hold on to your hats, because scientists at UCLA Health have just turned the world of neuroscience on its head with a discovery that's as shocking as it is revolutionary. Ready to dive into the world of mathematical microscopes and memory? Let's get started. Do you know that feeling when you walk into a room and forget why you're there? That's your working memory at play, or rather, failing to play its part. But imagine if your brain could improve that memory, not just when you're wide awake, but even during sleep. Researchers at UCLA, led by neurophysicist Dr. Mayank Mehta, have unveiled a groundbreaking mechanism that boosts memory efficiency while slashing the energy cost. And guess what? It happens in the very part of the brain where Alzheimer's disease begins. Intrigued? Let's find out how they did it. Traditionally, the entorhinal cortex is a star player in forming memories. This area is so complex that it's where Alzheimer's first takes hold. Understanding it could unlock early diagnostics for Alzheimer's and other memory impairments. To tackle this, Dr. Mehta and his team introduced what they call a mathematical microscope. Think of it as the Hubble telescope, but instead of exploring distant galaxies, it zooms in on the intricate dance of neurons in your brain. Mathematical models aren't new. They've revealed the secrets of everything from planets to black holes. But applying this precision to the brain's billions of neurons? That sounded like a fantasy, until now. Dr. Krishna Chudhari, the study's lead author, simplified this chaos to just two variables the input from the neocortex and the connections within the entorhinal cortex itself. Simple, right? But does this simplicity work? Enter Dr. Thomas Hahn and Dr. Sven Berger, who put this theory to the test with precision techniques that sound straight out of a sci-fi novel. They measured how neurons behave in real time, observing something extraordinary. Picture this. The signals from the neocortex are like ocean waves. Sometimes a wave forms, and the entorhinal cortex, like a skilled swimmer, rides the wave up. Other times, it dips down, choosing to ignore the wave. This action, or inaction, forms a new type of memory state called persistent inactivity. And here's the kicker. Persistent inactivity uses almost no energy. It's like putting your brain on energy-saving mode while doubling its memory capacity. Think about the implications for diseases like Alzheimer's, where energy use in the brain is a major issue. Dr. Meta pushed this model to its limits, and the results were astonishing. Every prediction made by their mathematical microscope matched perfectly with their experimental data, a feat almost unheard of in neuroscience. So next time you drift off to sleep, remember, your brain might just be optimizing your memories, thanks to the groundbreaking work of scientists who dared to dream big. Who knew sleep could be so productive? For more fascinating insights into the wonders of the human brain, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. See you in the next video.